Round seven of the 2022 Wrangler National Finals Rodeo presented by Teton Ridge in the Barrow Racing belongs to Wenda Johnson. Her and Mo get it done again here in Wenda for you guys. As we were just talking before this, it was just a smooth run from start to finish. And you said when Mo's smooth and you're smooth, it's a fast time. Absolutely. And that's one thing I definitely strive to to help them just be smooth and easy. The less I can do, the better off. And especially we just get to our points. I felt like we came into our first um, just really, really well. Get, got in, in there, he was a little tentative after, you know, the, the ice skating ground on round three was pretty <laughs> challenging for him. That's yeah. something he hasn't experienced yet. And I really did have to take the last few rounds, even though the ground was amazing, but I had to rebuild his confidence as a six-year-old that hasn't run on a ton of rodeo ground. And you know, and it's okay, look at the progression. Mm -hmm. He built some confidence right now, tonight, kind of right, went, went right into his spot, into one, which set us up for the rest of the run. You mentioned that a little bit, you get a little bit towards the, the top of the ground tonight, you move up just a little bit. Do you think that makes a, a ton of difference or is it just, you know, that just a slight difference can make a ton of difference? Absolutely. There, there's no doubt being on top of the ground is an advantage, but I will, I, I've got to give a huge shout out to the ground crew because the last two, three nights um, from five, five, six, five and six was amazing. Yeah. The ground, they were, were pulling checks on mm -hmm. the end of the, on the bottom of the ground. So, um, but there still is a, a bit <laughs> better advantage being top of the ground. Yeah, so then we take a look now at the next couple of days. We've got three more rounds left to go. Obviously focuses on the, the round that's in front of you. What type of mentality do you carry into these next couple of rounds? You know, it's the same approach I have. It's, it's really that night and what the horse I'm riding needs that night. So it's uh, the biggest focus and really I don't stray much from that. Not, not worrying about a world championship, right? No, you know Just what, honestly, it, look, we're all mounted. We all have mm -hmm. unbelievable horses. I mean, look at what Lisa's accomplishing. Exactly. She's, she's just climbing and doing amazing. Her horse is working so well. And um, it, the thing is, is we do have 10 rounds and you just yep. have to keep doing your best and it could be anybody's game. And I, and I hope that we stick in there. And the biggest thing is getting to our spots and making smooth, clean runs. Well, we hope to see more of it from you and Mo. Congratulations, Winda. There it is, Winda Johnson wins round number seven in the barrel racing at the 2022 Wrangler National Finals Rodeo presented by Teton Ridge.